with the first situation. All right. Now, if I take, if, if here's what I don't want you to do. I do not want you to pass the ball here. Okay. I don't want you to make that pass because what will happen is that this guy will have plenty of time to get over here to help. Okay. So you've got to wait on this. This guy has to wait. You have to wait. Do not make, do not make that pass. All right. So we're going to get some kind of penetration. So let's start to penetrate. Now you can penetrate in a couple different ways, right? I want you to think about, uh, think about this. You know, you can come straight down the middle, but what if you started off over here with the ball and now you started to dribble this way? What do you think this guy will do? Stay with you. He'll go with you for a while, won't he? All right, and now what if, you sh what if he gets to here? Is he still on you? Uh, maybe. And what if he's here? You may drag this guy way out of position. So if I'm in the equidistant mentality, if the ball moves from here to here to here, and this guy takes a step this way, or takes a step up and then takes a step over, what should this guy be doing? Okay, he's going to take a step here. All right. Now he could step into this area if he wants, because quite frankly, that might be a nice open look. All right. But just for the start of this thing, we're going we're gonna to have this guy come over here and come into this spot. Now, as these guys converge, all right, now think, do you want a little midget right here? You want your, your five foot three guard in this position? Or do you want somebody with a little bit more height? Okay. Well, a good passer, but he may be a good passer, but if he's only five three, uh, he may not be able to get the ball around these, uh, these guys here. So we'll talk about the individual personnel spots in a moment, but as this guy comes in here, this guy to take a step here. Now, if this guy starts to pick him up and he takes a step here, then what do you think this guy should do? Same okay, same thing. Thank you. He should take a step here or he should take a step here, one of these two. You might want that three-point line and you may say, these are my three-point shooters and I want them to have it, okay? All right, so let's say I come right to the middle here. We suck these guys in a little bit and now I want to throw it over here. What can I do to get everybody leaning that way? Ball fake. Okay, so it's a simple ball fake. I got the ball, I ball fake here, and notice I'm, I'm on my inside foot again. I ball fake to this side, that sucks everybody over to about here, okay? And then all of a sudden, I throw it back to this guy, okay? Now if I get it back to this guy really quickly, as soon as the ball leaves this man's hand, as soon as it leaves his hand, this guy races towards this spot. Now, if we did the ball fake, now we're going to do it right here instead of here. You see the difference? That's just a foot. But that might be the distance necessary to guarantee you're going to get a basket. So now I've got the question, who is guarding this guy right here? He now has